नमस्कार मैं अनिल जयसवाल आप देख रहे हैं वायरल खबरें आइए डालते हैं एक नजर मुंबई की खास खबरों पर I thoroughly enjoyed myself this morning interacting with the students and the management and faculty of the Aditya School of Business Management here in Borivali. It was a wonderful experience to interact with young minds, understand how they think. These are the leaders of tomorrow. These are the change makers of tomorrow. So it is my pleasure completely to be interacting with them and sharing my experience over the years on. certain wonderful achievements that mankind has managed to accomplish and some more things which need to be accomplished in the near future i believe these students are extremely bright extremely intelligent and they can think for themselves and move ahead so our attempt this morning through the session was to stimulate their thought make them think in a few directions which they have probably not thought about before open them to a few more perspectives which are sometimes even beyond curriculum and syllabus so we've gone into the aspects of mind management and energy management which is not part of curriculum and syllabus anywhere in the world but i hope these experiences will stay with the students for a lifetime i hope the stories and the pointers that we've shared with them will help them in their way ahead in their career ahead i'm sure all of them have a glorious career ahead of them in the corporate world and in any other field that they choose my humble attempt this morning has been to set them think in the right directions to open them to a few more dynamic perspectives of life which are truly life transforming so it was indeed a wonderful experience the energy rub off works both ways when we conduct motivational sessions we not only motivate the audience in front of us but we are motivated ourselves to live up to those standards uh, that we set in our interactions it was a wonderful and en- energy interaction and i thank the management of the aditya school of business management and the faculty and all the students for providing me this wonderful opportunity to interact with all of them thank you so much for the management uh, of uh, aditya school of business management faculty staff and students i would sincerely like to thank mr vivek shetty for coming over here for, uh, on the first day of the students uh, gathering that's prabandhan 2023 and sharing his experience uh, not just textbook experience but uh, even out of textbook what students can do and uh, i think it's a lot of things for the students who which can take away from here and uh, for in their journey for the next two years thank you so much mr shetty and uh, the management for providing this platform thank you everything may happen to you all this morning you have to go through some boring lectures and some boring people you have made to sit in this hall don't worry i always tell everybody before we start a session please don't suffer the speaker enjoy the speaker yeah so we got that jokes i'm going to tell you some very very interesting stories which may stay with you for a lifetime and please pay attention while we go through this process because one or two things that you may probably pick up this morning may change your life forever and as i go through this uh, interesting interaction i call this an interaction not a lecture each one of you sitting in this auditorium is bursting with energy and so am i so let's see how far we go this morning with our energies I don't use powerpoints anymore powerpoints are passe for me as a yogi i use energy points energy can transform life so i'm going to call a few of you all up here and do some interesting energy experiments with you it's good fun you will love it all right but let me begin by saying namaste yeah namaste is the anjali mudra in yoga and when you bring your hands together in this fashion with the fingertips touching each other you raise your inner vibration you raise your level of receptivity you raise your level of focus and you become in a sense you move towards oneness with the audience in front of you with the people in front of you that is the secret of the traditional indian namaste all right it's very very profound it's very very deep 
before I start any session, I would also like to acknowledge the Aditya School of Business Management for displaying exemplary vision in organizing sessions of this nature, which will give you insights which sometimes may not even be part of curriculum and syllabus anywhere in the world. So today I am going to share a few things with you which may not be part of curriculum and syllabus anywhere in the world. Please make the most of it. So congratulations Brian uh, to you sir and all the dedicated team of the Aditya School of Business Management here for organizing sessions of this nature. For me it is always a great pleasure to interact with young minds and uh, you know have some good fun. So that's how I look at this. Have a smile on your face and be relaxed. Take a deep breath. When you smile, it is health for you. If you frown, it is disease for you. Yeah? So please don't frown, smile, be relaxed and we'll enjoy the session this morning. I'll make two requests before I start any session. Don't worry, I'm not going to ask me a bank balance. Neither am I going to borrow money from any of you all. But the two requests are, please keep your spine erect as far as possible right through the session. What is the importance of an erect spine? Well, we all have heard and probably even studied the theory of evolution. As per the theory of evolution, we were probably monkeys or apes and gradually over a period of time, we evolved to become human beings. Am I right? Yes. Can I have some energy this morning? Some noise? Yes? Great. We all have had breakfast, I'm sure, this morning. Yeah? Now, as we evolve from being animals to being human beings, our spine also evolved from being horizontal to becoming vertical. Now see the difference in intelligence between animals and human beings. So in yoga we say, and as a yogi I say, the spine literally holds your intelligence. The spine is the center of your experience in the universe. And for those of you who don't believe me, conduct a small experiment with yourselves. Slouch a little bit, bend a little bit, observe your levels of attention and focus and awareness. You would have noticed your concentration has gone down, your focus is probably a little diminished, and you are no longer involved with whatever is happening around you to the extent that you should be involved. So that is the importance of the spine. Whenever you are doing something important in life, please, or in general, wherever possible, please keep your spine here. The second request. <coughs> now this is a far too cliche term. It has been used, <coughs> sorry, it has been used far too loosely. <coughs> but I am going to repeat this, be in the now. But what do I mean when I say be in the now? I am going to give you a very, very interesting humorous story 